Hey guys, what is going on? It is Obadiah and today we are back playing some ARK, but today we got something new. I mentioned this in the last video, but uh, I don't think my character customizations came in. What the heck? Um, normally I have black hair and he's not so ripped, uh, but whatever, it is what it is. Uh, we are actually on a new server. It's actually our old server, but we wiped it and uh, not the Redemption one, one before that and wiped it. And we are set up now on the new Valhalla map which is awesome, and on top of that, uh, we have Arc Eternal, as well as just some other mods and whatnot. Um, I already got on and built like a little thatch wall in this cave, kind of like a base. I thought it was a cool spot and wanted to kind of get on it real quick. Um, all I have right now is a sleeping bag and two boxes with a little bit of materials in it. I just wanted to get a little, little bit of foundation before we started here. Um, if you guys do enjoy these videos or if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button, and of course, feel free to subscribe and share and hit that notification bell to get all the notifications. Um, so at today, I guess what we're gonna do is kind of start just the basic stuff, gathering, getting some tools, uh, getting some stuff done. Get, oh, the dodo. Oh, I gotta kill that dodo. That's what I gotta do, kill that freaking dodo because we need some hide. In the beginning, for like the first couple days, hide is always like the, mo open please, like super, super valuable resource. Okay, let's grab, no, I know I made one of those reusable spears. We do have the reusable tools mod or whatever. Oh, that dodo's going down. He doesn't even know it. The sucker's gonna be ours. All right. Um, so the Architurtle mod already have been killed a few times just randomly. It's definitely dangerous. Um, I did fly around this map in like single player and stuff and it is cool. Oh, you're real close to that Bronto. And I am dehydrated. So first things first, let's take a drink. Thank you. Okay, come on, Dodo. Yeah, you mine. Level are you? 100? Uh, uh. Die. Die. There we go. Get that hide. Um, so we, I'll put all the rates and stuff and mod list in the description below, but we have, oh, there's more dodos. Whoa, 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 whoa. But uh, we've got kind of the same mods we had last time, very similar upgrade station, um, obviously Arc Eternal, uh, Jones Egg and Poop Collector, which we didn't have on the last one, but I really missed it, so I, we added it back on. Um, I forget what else, all sorts of stuff. We don't have basic flyers on here. The, where are you going, what? Come on, Super Dodo, get back here. Oh, come on. I'm at home, we have to chase this sucker down. Can you, oh, it's, that's a real high level. That's a real high level, level 560 Dodo. This might take a few hits. Um, now anyway, what's up with the mod list? The rates are, you know, moderate. They're not crazy. They're definitely higher than vanilla. Um, but I want the game to actually be challenging. So we don't put them like super, super crazy high like we have in some other servers because we actually want some things to take some work and some effort and all that. And look at this guy. Is he aggressive? Okay, let's get stamina first. Oh, I wanna go see what he is. Looks like some kind of poison trike. Hey buddy, level 80, are you uh, nope, not passive tameable? Okay, well I'm not gonna deal with you now. Are you, aggress are you aggressive? Are you aggressive, like in the last one? Oh. Oh, oh yeah he is. Hey. Hey, 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 hey. What level is he? Oh, you wanna go? You wanna fight? I'll take you out. Oh, double parasaurs. Oh, ho, ho. Was, oh, and I'm dead in one shot. Okay, I'm gonna recover my stuff. I'm just gonna gather some materials, try to get some hide and whatnot. Let's just respawn spawn randomly because I know we'll spawn close by. And then I got some stuff going and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys, we've got a bit of stuff built, even if it's not that much. We're gonna go ahead and start placing it down. Figure it's time to upgrade to wood. And we got these cool double doors, look at this. Oh, that's a neat old mosquito <laughs> from Structures Plus. Um, it's kind of neat. So I built some foundations. I didn't build enough foundations. I couldn't remember how many. Uh, no. There we go. I hate that you can't always see underneath thatch. It's very uh, frustrating. But whatever. It's time to start replacing this stuff. Get ourselves some wood, and then we'll get stone. And then by the time we do that, we'll probably want to move to another base anyway, so it won't really make a difference. But, oh, make more, make more, make more. Come on. Come on! Oh, and we leveled up. Um, so I'm obviously gonna need to do a bunch more gathering, just doing it by hand, but already we're getting things moving. And that is what I like to see. Can we make another one? All right, so I'm gonna go finish this thing out of wood, keep gathering some stuff, and then I'll bring you out. Oh, I also got a bed, hold on, hold on. That's important, I made an actual bed, not just a sleeping bag. And that's always a good thing. Can this rubble clear out, please? I got stuff to do, I got beds to place. Okay, let's just throw it over here. That's the sleeping spot. Right there, that's the one. 
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and keep replacing stuff, um, get this thing built up, make it closed off a little better, probably. And then I'll bring y'all back. All right, guys, I was out gathering and checking this out right next to our base. There's metal. What? That's like amazing for first off. I didn't even realize that. I just kind of logged in. I was like, this spot looks cool. Let's try it. But now we can get metal. We can't get a lot right now because we just have a stone pick, but it'll be enough to uh, get us a bunch of stone and we can make the forge and whatnot. And holy crap, metal straight off the bat. That's amazing. We're going to get ourselves some good stuff. All right, anyways, back to gathering. All right, guys. So the more I'm looking around this area, the more I'm like, man, this area is super awesome. Maybe we should just hang out here a while. So I've already built up a couple forges. Um, and I, oh, I wanna build a smithy. Let's just take all. We have enough weight, right? Ooh, and we are slowly dying of starvation. Um, smithy, oh, what am I short on? Metal ingots. That's right, I gotta put the forges down first. Um, Cause honestly, this area seems like it's got a lot of good stuff. Can we stick these? Oh yeah, S plus, stick that sucker right in the wall. So I think maybe we'll actually just go straight to stone and start expanding already just a little bit. And we don't need to expand a ton. Now let's do this. And uh, we don't need that much wood in there. How about just like a, a little bit? But man, this area is super cool and I really want to explore the rest of the map. So I'm sure we'll move at some point. But for now, I mean, I love this natural cover. We can expand it out to like here maybe, or just right under this overhang, just a couple more foundations out, give us way more room, go to this wall, and you can even like wall off that area and a wall there and make like a big old good sized dino pen. I don't know, this area is just so rad. If you're wondering where this is on the map, it's just in the starter area, like something Bay 3 is. Uh, okay, yeah, 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 we're dying of starvation, I know, but we're also about to die of thirst. So let's go get some water. I'm gonna start gathering stone now, holy crap. Because, I mean, just dang, <laughs> this is such a cool area. Uh, there's water nearby, which is great. That's a cool looking Bronto. Good stuff to tame, but nothing super crazy aggressive. Like we should be able to survive. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and get this thing made out of stone. Uh, get some metal tools, get some metal going, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, we saw this Rex was attacking a Bronto and then it um, got knocked out by this crazy trike right here. So we're gonna try to kill it with our, just our, Hatch it and take all of its hide, get the experience, heck yeah. Um, its bar doesn't seem to be going down, which seems weird to me. It makes me think it's gonna wake up at any moment and it's just not showing what it is. Also, this is gonna be a long fight. We might actually have to go get some more tools because I need to get the hide, I can't use this whole thing. I'm only doing 32 damage a hit. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and beat on this guy a while and kind of see, uh, hopefully we can kill him. Uh-oh, I hit something else. Oh, we're gonna die for sure. Oh no, it's running, yeah, run. Don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. This is this is a dangerous proposition. I can't tell if he's stuck or what. All right, we'll just keep beating this guy. All right, this sucker should be dying any second. We're almost there. This is taking forever. Come on, die, die, die. And there it is. Oh, get all the hide. Oh yeah, that's gonna last us a little while. Super score this early on. I am almost dehydrated. I am dying. Ooh, whoa. Hey there, bud. And this Bronto looks like he's about to die too. Can we need to drink some water? Man, we are all over the place right now. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna keep gathering. I think we're gonna have to go tame something soon. Uh, and then I will, I really want that Bronto to die. I need something else to attack it. Um, man, this trike though, knocked that sucker out. Like it was the thing to do. We may need to look and get ourselves one of these suckers. Uh, what level is he? Ooh, don't be aggressive. 340. I wonder how hard they are to knock out. We're gonna need to find a super spyglass. So first, we may need to get a Terra or something. Um, <laughs> I need to go make some more food and stuff, gather some more materials, start getting bolas and some, oh, I did notice there were, huh. I knew there was some kind of special magic arrow, eternal poison arrow made in the, can only be crafted at eternal craft station. So how do we make that? What? I see no eternal eternal workbench, maybe? Hide, oh, good thing we got all that hide. Uh, metal ingots and cementing paste. We have no cementing paste. Okay, so maybe we can't make those just yet. So we might have to start with the regulars, which is not what you wanna hear. Um, but I'm gonna see what I can find, try to level up, maybe try to kill some bugs and stuff. I'm not really sure, bunch of gathering and whatnot. And then I'll bring y'all back. 
All right, guys, so I went ahead and made an upgrade station. We're gonna have to move all this stuff around later because clearly this is not where it's gonna end up being. Um, and a crossbow. I wanna see if we can actually upgrade. I just have everything I own in my inventory right now. It's kind of insane. Um, let's see if we can upgrade this crossbow. We can, again? Heck yeah, one more? Oh, wow. What? I didn't even think we'd get anywhere close to that far. Awesome. And then uh, let's take all this stuff back. <laughs> And, uh, oh, great. So, and let's go ahead and transfer all into here. So, there's a couple things I want to do. Number one, I want to get a Pteranodon and make a saddle. Oh, speaking of which, let's take it all back. Do I even have enough for a Pteranodon saddle? Put, do I even have a Pteranodon saddle learned? No. Put Pteranodon. Let's learn that. Pteranodon saddle. Okay. Now, do I have enough to make a Pteranodon saddle? No. What am I short on? Oh, chit and carriage, and I still have none of that. I really need to find some. Yeah, okay. Um, and I need to get some crystal to make a super spyglass. So I think I'm actually gonna leave everything here. Is that one full? Let's transfer everything, everything else in here. Transfer, 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 transfer. Except for a pick. <laughs> Take some food with me. I'm gonna see if, we, if I can find, let's up movement speed a bit here. Movement speed and stamina. I'm just gonna run and see if I can actually find any any crystal. I'm gonna go have to go up that mountain. I'm probably gonna die, but uh, we're gonna try it. Cause if I can get some crystal, I can make a super spyglass. Man, this Bronto still hasn't died. Somebody's gonna kill this guy. So I can see the torpor on these guys. Cause if I can tame something up with fairly low torpor, using like the blue narcotics that we used in uh, the last mod, cause we do have that on here as well. That might be really useful. Um, oh, there's so much stone here. This is awesome. This is a really good resource area. I'm actually really happy with it. <laughs> that the first area that we saw and picked. Oh, that's a lot of bugs. Woo! Okay, you know what? Let's let's go for it. You bugs are mine. They're gonna kill me like straight away, aren't they? Yep. Good times. Okay, so that was not the best idea. So, um, I'm going to respawn, try to get my stuff back, keep looking for crystal, and then I'll bring you guys back. All right, guys. So we realized. Uh, that if a trike, one of these poison trikes, knocks something out, we can tame it. So we don't have any, like, special kibbles or anything. So I couldn't tame, like, that alpha terror bird that guy guy's eaten. But I saw some, like, knocked out carnos and rexes and stuff. I'm starving. I'm always starving, it feels like. So I grabbed some meat and some berries. And I'm kind of looking around now. I was looking for crystal and I got some, oh, I also made some hide armor. Cause if I see something cool knocked out that we, oh, stupid bugs, go away from me. I don't want to handle you right now. Oh, whoa, 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 big old hole in the ground. But if we find something knocked out that we can tame, we'll just steal it. So I'm gonna keep looking around. I did see like a Carno and a Rex up here earlier that were knocked out, but clearly they've been killed now. <laughs> They're not here anymore. Um, but if I find something good, I'll bring you guys back and hopefully we get a free tame. All right, guys, it looks like there's a knocked out Rex right here. How close is he to being a lot awake? Oh, I don't even know if we have enough meat. We have 43. Will it even do anything? Not even close. Do we have anything else? Oh, let's see, what will that put him at? Oh yeah, we ought to take our meat back. Ugh, okay, is there something we can kill here for meat? Oh, there were some dodos. Okay, uh, uh, okay, we got this. I wanna tame this guy. If we can kill these dodos and get some meat. Okay, uh, oh, there's also a lava golem over here who killed me. I'm hoping we don't aggro him again. Are these guys gnarly? Hey, bud. Okay, they're not aggressive, that's good. Come on, give me all your meat. Give me all your meat, give me all your meat. Okay. Come on. Come on, we gotta hurry up! Okay, uh, meat, pick. Okay, that's 23. Oh, where's that lava golem? That must be that rock right in front of us. So we need 100. We've got 79. Oh, that might be enough. Can we kill one more? If, there's w if there was one more dodo, I think we could do it. We're gonna start out with an awesome Rex. I'm just gonna throw it on there, see what happens. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Do it. Okay, 1.5 each. A little less, like 1.4, so we might need one more dodo. Anything around here? 
Anything at all? Oh, now this is some tall grass. Holy crap. I can't see anything. <gasps> Dodo. Dodo, you're mine. Now, I don't even know if we have any way to make a wreck saddle. I don't even know if we're high enough level to make a wreck saddle. But I do know this guy will follow us around and protect us forever. Or probably until the first thing attacks us and then die instantly because he's not a super dino. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Throw it on there. What's his taming effectiveness look like? 118 levels, 45% taming effectiveness. That's what you like to see, isn't it? Eat it. Oh, get away. Please don't aggro. Okay. Whoa. This thing's... Oh, ooh, how much health does this have? Uh, way more than we can kill with our pick. Okay. Parasaur. Okay, I think we're just gonna wait. I think that's probably enough. Where's our guy? How you doing, guy? Are you all right? You feeling good? Ooh, 61% done. Can I please get... Can you guys leave my Rex alone? Seriously. Get off his back. His literal back. Alright, well I guess I can't access his inventory anyway because all the Brontos in the world are just freaking molesting him. There we go. Okay, 51 left and he's at 84%. Oh, yeah. yeah. I don't even know what it takes to make a Rex saddle. Let's check. We'll wait for this guy. We are not even a high enough level. But hey, we'll have him. We'll just put him on neutral and maybe he'll save our lives. And oh my gosh, look at that Cardo. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We got him. Put him on passive. Come on. Let's get you home, bud. Let's get away from this Cardo who will probably one-shot you. Come on, you can do it. <laughs> so maybe we didn't get all the chitin we need. Oh, there's that golem. Come on, come on. Run, 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 run. Come on, Rex, buddy. No, don't hurt him. No. No, you can do it. Sneak past. Run. Run. This way. Juke him. Why is he so slow? Oh, and a raptor. Uh, uh. This is bad news. No, 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 no. No fall damage. No! My Rex is definitely gonna die now. Because who's he gonna follow? Uh, well, it was a good plan, but holy crap, everything is so freaking dangerous. All right, let's see if we can salvage the situation. I at least want to try to get my body back if I can, because I had some good stuff. Oh, and there goes the Rex. He died. And there's the Raptor. And I'm guessing that's where my body is. Oh, yeah. All right, guys. Well, I couldn't find my body, uh, but I think that's going to be it for day one. I mean, hey, we got a base built. Yeah, we lost a bunch of stuff, and we tried to get that <laughs> Rex the cheaty way, but um, which is probably what we deserve for having it killed within like two minutes. But whatever. Um, it was quite a fun day. This server is so dangerous. We do have dino spawns turned up, so there are tons of stuff everywhere, and it's crazy. Uh, but if you guys did enjoy that video, if you learned something, do me a favor and hit that thumbs up button. And of course, feel free to subscribe and share and hit that notification bell if you haven't done so already. You can also check me on all your social medias, your Twitter, your Instagram, your Facebook, even your Google+, Plus, even though nobody ever uses it. And check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash obadix. I also have a link to a Streamlabs tip jar in the description below if that's the kind of thing that you're into, because I am too. Uh, anyways, guys, I really do appreciate you guys coming to hang out with me, and until next time, I will see you later.